Hello, hello, everybody. How you doing today? What day is it? Thursday? When? Thursday? It's Thursday today. Hi, how you doing? We're here. We're just check checking out the uh, Zedcraft stream. The Zedcraft stream? The Zedcraft world. And then we'll be heading on over to Hermitcraft in just a little bit. But uh, obviously we had some spooky times recently and um, on the Zedcraft server there was this whole Halloween district and yes I missed the boat completely because that was like four days ago now. <laughs> but I really wanted to show it off because uh, there's some spooktacular looking stuff here. The noise is coming through my ears right now. Thank you so much everybody. Burp Potato, thank you so much for the unlucky 13 months of Muggly Mugs. Appreciate that. Vamp Gator, you too. Four months. Four months. Thank you so, so much. E double D, 20 months. Mug, mug, mug. Uh, some bits coming in from Van Gator as well. Thank you very much. Do appreciate the support. And Danny Rose, sub baby with nine months. Mugs to you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, yeah, so we are here on Zedcraft. We're not on Hermitcraft right now. We will be heading on over to there in a little bit. But uh, is, there a, is, is there a ghost behind me? <laughs> I think there might be a ghost behind me. Um, yeah, this is the Zedcraft server, folks. Um, and this is our very rainy, very, very swampy um, Halloween district. Um, that we set up last month. Obviously, uh, we had a little hangout where we uh, we started some things off. Some very cool places around here. So uh, just wanted to give a quick little tour, quick little show it off um, thing. We usually kind of do a live stream near the end of the month to show it off, but I couldn't really do anything at the end of the month. I was busy, so we kind of did a thing at the beginning of the month instead, but then I didn't get to show off the final thing. It's a whole thing, but um, yeah, we'll show it off today now instead. So uh, how are we all doing? How are we all doing? It's Friday, Nugget for you. What kind of world do you live in? How does that work? I guess some people are like eight hours ahead or something? Mars did, oh, so it's, it's Australia. Yeah, of course, you, you guys are all super far ahead. That scares me. <laughs> okay, cool. So this this was our little uh, witch hut spawning thing. We come in here. There were some ideas we threw around um, together to work on. Some community supplies left out. The place is a bit of a mess, but what's scarier than a mess? You know? Ooh, real, real scary mess going on. Look at this thing. It's so cool. Oh, I've not got my zoom button. What's going on? Where, where's my zoom button gone? Do I press this button? No, I don't know. Um, massive, massive uh, pyramid here. Okay, let's let's start off with the pyramid, shall we? We'll just whiz through some stuff. Um, I'm in cheaty mode as well, so that we can hopefully uh, see it a little bit easier. Is this like a? Are these eyes? Is this a big weeping eye? Am I, am I heading into the eye of the the storm right now? Let's let's go into survival mode. Boom, so we can check it out. You know what they say? It's Friday in New Zealand. That really does sound like a. Is that a real saying? Because it should be one. Um, yes, Sledgehammer, this is all totally survival. It's just me. Me, that's the big cheaty, cheater face. Um, because I can. <laughs> um, but yeah, all this was done completely in survival. The death count leaderboard and instructions. Okay, welcome to Death Loop Pyramid. Oh boy. Please take everything off and put in the double chest, including your armor and your totem. Set your spawn, blah, blah, blah. You're allowed to take food in with you. Okay. Okay, we are definitely going to be setting the spawn here, though. Um, let's give this a go. What was it? Death Loop Pyramid. <laughs> this is a little smoky. Um, where do I even go? Okay, I go to there. I I'm assuming this is the parkour. Um, I see. Oh, ow, 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 ow. You can't shift on this. Okay. Okay. Oh, I failed. I failed already miserably. No, let me up. I want to live. Okay. I survived. This is tricky. I'm not good at parkour. Um, <laughs> oh, I'm like, thank you for the raid. Welcome, welcome, raiders. Let me just uh, heal up a little bit. My goodness me, this place, this place is a death trap. The smoke inhalation alone is is dangerous. <laughs> okay, let's try this jump again. I'm not going to be able to do the whole thing. I know it for for a fact. As long as we keep eating, we can always um, run back to that little starting point. Okay, we jump. We jump. I just want to make sure I do, like, the first bit. There we go. See, we can set our spawn. We're all good. Checkpoint, baby. That's it. <laughs> this place is really cool. I have no idea, like, how big it is going to be, you know? The pyramid was pretty large. Uh, where are we headed to? Why are there items over... Why is there bows and items and things? Is this something I should be doing or, or using? Oh. Oh. Hang on a minute. I can't go that way. Do I have to do... What is what is all this? <laughs> I'm very confused. I think it's kind of like a puzzle as well. Have I got to like hit something somewhere? 
Oh my goodness me, I was not expecting to have to use my brain today. Not one little bit! And I have to use all the brain. Oh no, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, just here. Just put myself out, please. The target block, where? I see the target block! But I'm gonna burn to death first! I, I did it! I died! I died it! <laughs> <laughs> okay, right. We want to be able to show some things off here. So let's um, let's not head into that mode. Let's in head into some spectator stuff. So I did it. It's like a puzzle parkour, which is very, very cool. Bows go back up here. Oh, my bow. Oh, I should probably, uh, I should probably get that. Oh, back up here. Let's put them up there. <laughs> sort of cheat our way through. Okay, what does this section do? Oh. This is scary just thinking about it. That's a Z. That's the scariest of all letters. I genuinely don't know what the, what you'd have to do here. But I'm assuming I if I played it properly, I would find out. So I'm probably asking all the wrong questions. I guess you just jump down to there. You walk around this bit. This is an odd collection of blocks, I tell ya. I tell ya! Very, very prettily done, though. Very, very Halloween-y and spooky. <laughs> Oh my goodness, what is this? This looks like one of those horror corridors where like a big wall of spikes come down or something. <laughs> oh, only bows in the barrel, arrows in the other. I, I didn't listen. I didn't listen to the to the things. Whoopsie. This, this is way more complicated than I ever even dreamed. It's crazy though, like look how big the pyramid is. Again, in survival. Like, and this is just the Halloween district too. This wasn't like, um you know... An entire base or anything like that. <laughs> very, very cool stuff. Okay, so there's all these little ghosts everywhere as well. Let's go check out the ghost ship now. This is very cool. It got nighttime, which is good. No one on the server sleep. Oh, we've got lightning as well going on. Look at this. Very haunting um, fantasy, fantasy stuff. Um, <laughs> I look, I'm all right at the moment. Thank you. Look at this boat, though. How cool is this with the dead sails all creepily done? The ectoplasm waves or something. Enter if you dare. I do dare. Open for a treat. Okay, I always like a treat. What is it? Oh, oh. Trick or treat yourself and have a good day. Hmm. Good, thank you. I will take both of those and I will try and have a good day. Thank you very much. Spooky boat. Excellent. I love this. I love boats. I've never built a big boat before. They're just too... Unsquare, you know, that's that's my issue. If it's not square, I can't do it. But that is very, very cool. Very, very beautiful stuff. Uh, here we have um, a big phantom manor. This was uh, Dot's Dot's massive phantom manor here with a with a very luxurious entrance staircase. I must say, um, <laughs> the ghosts the ghosts look very cool, don't they? But look at this place, very imposing. I'm not sure some of this is finished, by the way. Um, but this place. It's super cool. Look at this massive staircase. Imagine if the manor places, the mansions in-game actually kind of looked a little bit more like this. Very cool table with cake. Can't go wrong with a bit of cake. Love it. Nice. And very, very spooky, gaudy wallpaper. Right? I love that too. Oh, that goes nowhere. Boom. Let's get back into human form a little bit. What's up here? My, is this curtains? Are they drapes? <laughs> Mahusive drapes. Oh my goodness, though, this place is awesome! Big old chandeliers and things, and candle holders. And this? What is this? Is this an organ? Is this a grand piano or an organ? Or a coffin? Or all of the above? A piano coffin, that would be pretty cool, wouldn't it? Very cool furniture, I must say, like super... I struggle to just make a normal chair, let alone a, a themed chair. You know, that's, that's crazy. But um, you're off. Thank you very much for raiding with a party 14. Hello. Welcome, raiders. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We're on the Zedcraft server at the moment. Oh, that's a spooky, spooky room of unfinishedness of pumpkins. Ooh, super spooky. But yeah, very, very cool. Let's take a look at the manor from the outside as well a little bit. Um, I, I believe I have seen the Phantom Manor, right? There's one at the at Disneyland Paris, correct? Because if so, I have seen it with my own eyes. Um, <laughs> exactly, Lisa. Super spooky, unfinished areas. 
Um, oh, and Anarchy, thank you very much for subscribing with Prime for the very first time. Do appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Look at this. I love the, the, the little roof spiky bits. And the color scheme of it as well is very, very cool. Don and I have been having many conversations about how we want gray wood. We want some gray wood in the game, you know? We were hoping that maybe the, the new wood coming in the next, next version, or the next, 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 next next version or whatever it ends up being um some gray wood would be nice please um but yeah that's very very cool very very spooky very very mannery i guess it's got good manners okay what do we got down here we have i believe this is like a little trick-or-treat lane look at the baby ghost oh he's very cute wait are you made up of oh no you are just a head the line down the middle i thought it was made up of two halves of a head i was very confused it does look similar to the Disneyland version. Okay, is that is that the... Which Disneylands are we talking here? It's the only one in Paris. The only one is in Paris. Okay, that's good to know. Then I have seen the one and only. Um, Ness's house. Step inside for treats. Okay, we can pick up some trick or treats. Ooh, a creeper treat bucket. Hello. Can I put you down without losing you? You are fantastic. Ah! Oh! <laughs> that's very cool. Okay, I like that. Thank you very much, Ness. What else have we got down here? Tricks. Treats one at a time. Tricks one at a time. Press the button for a trick or treat. Wait, I'm confused. I press his nose. I got Angel's head. Is that a trick or a treat? I think you can deposit your own, by the way, I think. So we could we could be like, here, here is a treat. Someone can have a golden carrot. Thank you. I will, I will take this. I'm assuming it's a treat. I'm going to be nice. <laughs> Tone, you reckon it's a trick? Okay, well... We'll see. I'm I'm saying on record, it's a treat, right? You heard it here. Uh, Young Guns Trick or Treat Cottage now open. Please read for. Oh, hello, Sp hello. Spooky posters all over the place. Hello. <laughs> oh, this is an odd scene. What have I walked into here? Welcome to Young Guns Trick or Treat Cottage. How it works? Each player is allowed two button presses. You may press one button twice or each button once. I'm confused. Very confused. Nuclear Chili, thank you very much for subscribing. With a prime, a mug, a mug, and a mug. Thank you so much. Do appreciate the support there. Trumpets going off all over the place. Uh, please turn, please, over what you receive. If you choose the trick button, you have a one in nine chance of receiving a special gift, but you also have an eight in nine chance to receive junk. Okay. If you choose treat button, you will always receive the gift. However, the most expensive rare gifts, turn, please, over, are dispensed by the trick button. Ooh. 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 No peeking in droppers. Okay, so this is the this is the trick and this is the treat. So we could get a better thing. I could press both buttons once or one button twice. I've forgotten the rules. Two button presses. Okay, I'm gonna go trick. Ah, oh. ah, oh, rotten flesh all the way. That's a shame, and I'm really tempted to peek as well. Okay, well maybe I like rotten flesh. Maybe that's exactly how I like my flesh. Rotten and tender. You know, sometimes a Minecraft steak looks a bit chewy, but the rum flesh, oh, it just crumbles, crumbles in the mouth. Mmm, delicious. Okay, right, what have we got going on over here? Is this just a a cow, an animal cat? I feel like this was an unintentional prison, but spooky, right? Oh, colourful sheep, <laughs> cows trapped. I mean, if you're a cow, that's like super spooky, so. Okay, What? what is this? What is this? Flying candles. Very, very creepy. Flying skulls as well. Right, read first. Oh my goodness, it's a lot of pages. A lot of reading. I'm, I'm not one for reading. I, I, I can read. I just don't enjoy it. Um, you may die playing this game. Head to the head to the welcome center first. Okay, remove all your stuff. Ba ba ba. The standard stuff. Okay, stand on the crimson red plank. Okay, we'll, we'll try and figure it out. Is this? Yeah, this is the welcome center. Okay, very good. Set our spawn. Um, I will put my things away in a locker because I will die. Um, I know it for a fact. It's going to happen. Um, crispy bacon flavored rotten flesh. Wow. I feel sick. Hey, that's my treat thing. Okay. Read the rule book. I mean, we technically read it. We didn't read all of it. Um, did you empty your inventory? So I've got to stand. I've got to stand here. What's that? That looks like my head. I've got to stand here and then flip this. Push button. Huh. 
I see a waist <laughs> and feet. Whoa, goodness me. Okay. I got a beacon? When did that happen? Who are you? <laughs> did he just poop a beacon at me? I don't know. Oh, because of the game mode. Oh. Was I supposed to die? But I got I got a beacon. So that's all good. Here, let me let me put the beacon over here. Let me go in again. And see if something different happens. <laughs> I hear things happening. Oh, I don't want to get a second beacon though. That would be cheating. I will I will place it back if that happens. Does anything happen? Did I do it too quick? Uh oh. I'm ruining everything here. Okay. I take this beacon. Uh uh. I, I'm putting it there. Okay. Good. Everybody knows. <laughs> I think that might have been a zombie with my face on it. So, you know. Scary, scary things. Um <laughs> Uh, okay, right. What else have we got around here? Oh, I see a big sp spooky tree over there. Let's try and move our way through nicely. Big old pumpkin here. Big old jack-o'-lantern. Hello. Okay, we go in the the jack-o'-lanterns. Oh, this is this is a maze. Okay, I did not know this was here. Right up, down, start. Okay, let's go to the start. Oh my goodness, I'm already lost. Huh. Ah. Uh. That's weird. Okay. Hello. Hello. This looks very familiar. Was this not on Hermitcraft a, a season or two back? This looks exactly the same as a room that I, I had been in. Um, okay, wait, wait. What have we got to do here? Uh, put all three stacks in the start chest. Yeah, you've got to take three stacks of pumpkins. Boop, boop, boop. Okay. Game starts when you place your pumpkins here. Boop, boop, boop. Is this, the, is this what I've done before? Wait, we gotta we gotta play the three the three things. Do you hear anything? Spooky, scary skeletons. Okay. Um. Oh. Uh oh. What happened? Did I do it? Did I do it? Guess all three songs correct. Okay, so Spooky Scary Skeletons is definitely one of them. Isn't that Nightmare on Elm Street? That's not an option. Twilight Zone, Thriller Night. It's not Nightmare Before Christmas. Not Adam's Family. It must be the Twilight Zone. I, I really thought that was Nightmare on Elm Street. I don't know. And then the first one, I'm just super confused. Oh, Adam's family, I can hear it now. Okay. Diddle da diddle da diddle da Look at that. Okay. To get the iron door to proceed to the next challenge. I must have done something wrong because I've guessed all my guesses and it hasn't worked. Maybe it wasn't Twilight Zone then. Oh, Halloween theme. I've cut the. Bleh. There. Good. Doors open. I knew it. I knew I was nearly right or wrong. Oh, this is so cool. Yeah, I've, I've literally played this game before on Hermitcraft. This is like a block of a block recreation. This is very cool. Okay, so yeah, if you want to see me play this one, go check out season six. Season six of Hermitcraft. I think it might be one of my last episodes, in fact. Um, very, very cool stuff, though. I can't believe it's a complete recreation. Look, but yeah, we got this maze here that I absolutely nailed. Uh, this was just a thing, a place. Okay, very, very cool stuff. Okay, right, where are we headed to next? Let's go see the big spooky tree. This thing is epic. Even in the day, it's a little bit scary. Um, yeah, yeah, likely fit it was. It totally was. Very, very cool stuff. Compost to make plants happy if you dare. We have cookies. Tip. Face will change. My face? My face? I like my face. Okay, uh, we'll do some warped war, I guess. Hello, little minion people. Hello, big scary tree. You, you, you look probably scared. Do I have to make compost? There. Ha! Ah, his face changes. He smiled. And he gave me cookies. And now I could I could put the cookies back. I can give them back to you. And it's like a never-ending... It's like a cookie farm. Oh, now he's angry again. Oh, no, he just did like a little face scrunch. <laughs> that is super cool. Look at him. 
How I kind of want to know how he's working. Oh, there's a little Zaf plushie on there too. He's got like a tail. This is like a, an ent, right? A tree ent. Very nice. Okay. You say I'm an underrated content creator. Well, thank you very much. I, I appreciate that. But, you know, I'm glad you enjoy watching. I guess that, that's what that means. Oh, here's the bouncy castle, I, I believe. Anyway, I'm. I, this might have been broken. We were having a little chat earlier. Stand on the slime blocks, then press the button. Okay, yeah, I think it was broken earlier. Oh, beautiful fireworks going off. Oh, but we didn't get launched up. Yeah, okay, so I'm guessing we can recreate it here. We can go, wee, and then we would end up up here among the fireworks, watching them bang and explode all over our face, which is very cool. Um, yeah, lovely little Halloween bouncy castle. I haven't been on a bouncy castle for years, and I still haven't. Still haven't. Okay, uh, where else have we got some stuff? This is a big swamp, by the way. I think I think we're, we've seen a good chunk of it though, so don't don't worry too much. We'll be heading to Hermitcraft soon. Um, okay, here we have something that I helped work on. We tried to make a, a maze, like a hedge maze, um, and I wanted to use like uh, hexagons instead of like squares or something. So this is a hexagonal maze. Um, but I don't think we finished it too much. No tricks, only treats. There are 10 barrels inside. Can you find them all? Okay. Here we go. It's the, I love the, the use of this, the azalea bush with the moss on top. Like, super hedgy. The fact that you could just do this to make a really, like, opulent hedge row somewhere. Like, oh, it's beautiful. I need to do it. They, they merge so nicely. Um, we're looking for what? Barrels? I'm already lost. Like, the fact that this is made of hexagons, it... Oh, a barrel! Probably save toadstool. Totally save toadstool. I, I like to roll the dice. <laughs> I like to play dangerously. What's in this one? It only touched the floor for a second. Ah, you know. Three second roll. Boom. Look, it's my first time ever having a spider's eye in my face. Look at that. <laughs> That's very, very cool. It's It's... Very difficult to do as well. It's it's much harder than a than a than a regular hedge maze. I feel because every room looks the same. It's like you don't know where you're going. Um, okay, here we have something very special. Um, I didn't want to do a pumpkin carving competition uh, at all this year. I wanted to do everything else other than a pumpkin. So any other fruit or vegetable um, you could you could carve, but you were not allowed to do pumpkins. So this right here is not a pumpkin. Orange, you glad I am here from Ped. This is an orange, of course, and it does look a lot more oranger than a than a pumpkin, I guess. But it's kind of, it's, it's sort of twisting it. It's, it's managing to to still make it look very Halloweeny, um, without breaking any of the rules. This there's Willy the worm there. The early worm carves the apple. Very nice, very horrific, very good. Yeah, you can carve an apple quite nicely. Is it uh, Endo Lantern? So it's like a, a a chorus fruit, a carved chorus fruit. Yes, hello. Over here, what is this? I'm trying to guess the fruit first. Is this a... Is this a watermelon? Oh, it's a face! <laughs> I didn't realise it's a face! Are you a watermelon? It's a pomelo. I don't know what a pomelo is, but I'm guessing it's a watermelon. Or something similar. Um... <laughs> the sheep is inside doing the maze over there. Yeah, I think so. I love the depth to it, though. I'm going to go inside this one's head because it looks like... Oh! Oh, there's stuff and things. Oh, is, oh, is it going to glow? I think it might glow if we hit the lever. Huh. Flick the lever in the darkness. It's hard to see. But I'm assuming it's it's glowing around now. Or, or not. I don't know. It looks like some cool stuff happens in there, which is... I like my fruit to have redstone in it, you know? Um, this is a carrot monstrosity. Look at you. When vegetables go bad. Oh my goodness. That... This is this is awesome. I love that. I love the the, the eyes. <laughs> they speak to me. And yeah, this, this time the carrot is eating me. Um, which I like. So that's good fun. What do we got over this side? Is this a cherry? Uh, Mr. Happy Apple. Oh, it's another apple. Look at you. Very, very happy. That's a fake smile. That's a forced smile. That's like a, you know, when you see like a clown and they've got like a big scary smile. It's like, that's not real. And maybe it's a cherry dressed as an apple. 
with a fake smile on it. We don't know. <laughs> we don't know, but we do know this one is a is a Z Cumber badge. It's a Z Cumber. Yep, that's exactly what it is. <laughs> I love these. Look at these like flower things. That's really cool. Very very cool use of that. And yeah, of course, it's got my face on it. So um, yeah, I'm gonna I am gonna have nightmares about this tonight. Uh, being turned into a Z Cumber. Um, <laughs> uh, over here we have oh spooky eggplant, the haunted aubergine. Oh, see, good aubergine in England, eggplant in I think the rest of the world or America at least. But why is it haunted? Oh, it's got it. Oh, you got to turn your head like that, but it's got a face. It's got a whole face and eyes, and these are its teeth. It's quite nice. It's very geody actually inside. It looks quite um. What is this? This looks succulent eggplant. Is this block block an eggplant block? Is this a block of eggplant? How do I see? It is smooth sandstone. Wow, I did not think it was going to be that. I'll tell you now. <laughs> uh, oh, what's? Oh, wait. Is this is this a fruit? Is there a fruit in here? Or is this just the outside world? I think that's just the outside world. Okay, that's all of our carved uh, fruit and vegetables. I do believe. I hope I didn't miss any. Um, what have we got over here? Spooky graveyard. Some graves going on. Look at this. Very spooky. Very spooky. I like it, though. It's nice and opulent. Have a little Z memorial thing. So much death. <gasps> spooky. And this is like the little, the little house, which looks like a face. If a face looks like a house. No, if a house looks like a face, it's creepy. But this is cool. I like this. With the window texture and everything. And there's a ghost up there, too. Checking out the windows, just staring out into space. Everything's sort of a little bit maybe overgrown. That's a cool organ, I must say. Is it playable? It looks playable. It's not playable. <laughs> I thought it might be, but it's not. It's not. Um, the door's gone missing. Oh, no. How horrific. <laughs> it's aubergine in, in France, too. Okay, interesting, Burt Potato. You should know being a vegetable yourself. Um, okay. Ah, uh, good. I pressed the wrong button. Over here. Oh my goodness me. This still very much looks like a work in progress, but I think I know what it is as well. This is a Frankenstein's monster. The ultimate Frankenstein's monster. Boom. We got a body part log. My favorite kind of log and some rules over here. It's time for science together. We will create the ultimate monster. I like it. I'm dressed for the occasion. Please use your creativity to build body parts onto the monster. You can build any part, anywhere, any style. Please follow the simple guidelines. Yeah, so the point was everyone to get together and build this big, weird monster out of stuff. Let's have a quick flick through the thing. We've got a pig's foot. We've got swamp. We've got... Oh, a swamp monster foot. That makes a lot more sense now. I was like, a swamp isn't a body part. If so, I don't have a swamp. Do I? I didn't think I did. Um, Ghost Keeper did the pus infected leg. Uh, we've got a mecha skelly rib cage, as you do, um, a scabby knee, <laughs> uh, and a dangly bloodshot eye. Okay, there's the pig's trotter with a with a bone, and this side it's like the the, the claw thing, and this one's not even attached. Very very gross. Oh, oh, is this pus? Is the yellow stuff pus? We've got the dangly eyebrow, eye, not eyebrow, eyeball, sorry. Um, eyebrows aren't that scary. We've got the mecha rib cage. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh. and then scaffolding. Whoa. <laughs> Again, a little unfinished, but who's Frankenstein monster isn't particularly unfinished. And who's to say, who's to say when it is finished either? You can stop whatever you like. It's your own monster. You can build, you know, build it as you like. It's your own DIY project. Okay, over here we do have some very, very cool trees. Uh, we have a theatre. Oh, nice. Okay, let's visit the theatre. Oh, 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 wrong button. Okay, let's get into survival mode. Okay, tickets. Oh, you got to buy them. Tone, Pidwen. Look away real quick. I hope you don't mind if I get him for, for free, because I, I, I have no gold upon my person. Um, I, I, I will just... I will just take one, thank you. Um, Lolo cried, thank you so much for 19 months of mug. Muggity, mug, mug. Mug, muggity, mug, mug. Yeah, that's what I'm going to say now. Thank you. 
Oh, better yummy. Okay, entry and exit only. Good, I'm going in the right way. Um, what is this again? A theatre? We, what are we here to see? Give, throw your ticket to the cashier. Oh, that's rude. No, I would like to gently pl place it in your hand. Huh. Is this open? Pull lever to begin. Please don't throw items at the performers. Okay, now, now we're getting polite. You know, the ticket guy, do what you like. Okay, pull the lever to begin. <laughs> that's some funky dancing that's my level of dance skill i do i do hate that at a wedding or something like that you go there and you got to kind of dance and i just sort of move a little bit like that i just kind of sit in a minecart really um nice and catchy it's a little bit faster tempo does it just keep going <laughs> I think it's on a loop. That's so cool though. I love that. And do 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 do. I almost ended it at the right time. Very, very cool stuff. Okay, I, I got my money's worth. Um and have you been thrilled? Then you get your free gift. I've been thrilled! Yay! Oh good. I'm glad. I've always wanted a thrilled t-shirt. Um <laughs> very groovy. Yeah, totally. That's what I'm all about. I'm about groove. I'm about the groove. Okay, which direction did we come from? We came from over there, I believe. So we have a couple more buildings over here. Oh, this one we missed from earlier. Um, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, yes, I'm not mistaken. This is the Ghostbusters house, <laughs> workplace. Look at that. Okay, Ghostbusters, Meldassian, and Addy. Okay, here we go. Is this like a super recreation? What, what was this? Oh, that was a shulker room. Okay. That's the outside world. Ghost us is map one diamond block. Oh, look at that. Okay. That's really cool. Okay, cool. So people can buy that and put that up like a poster. We got a very cool um, amount of different poster stuff going on on the server. It's very, very nice. Very, very nice. That's cool. I haven't watched Ghostbusters for a long, long time. I've not seen... The, well, the new one, is it even out yet? I don't know. I haven't seen it. Um, and the previous one, the, uh, the 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 reboot, I have not seen either. But the original, I love the original Ghostbusters. With the fireman's poles. Oh, yeah, you can do it and everything. Oh, now I'm down. Okay, back up we go. Okay. Very important, the shulker room. You gotta, you can't forget the shulker room. I was hoping there'd be the, the, the car somewhere as well. It's, that's so cool, though. <laughs> <laughs> Do they show off this many rooms in the film? I think some of this you might have had to imagine. Um, and it looks like the walls are made of are made of aubergine as well, which is also a fact from the movie. They actually used aubergine um, to make the walls. Look at this place. So much room. Oh, and this is a double... Okay, yeah, this is the one we're going down. Ghostbusters. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. I don't, I, I, okay, good job we can, we can fly around. I need my things back. Where's my t-shirt? Okay. Very good, very good. I could have known. It was a little predictable, though it was a hay block. And, you know, they're supposed to be good, but, excuse me, Mr. Ghost, don't mind me. I'm just coming under your, under your floaty bits. Okay, this tower here looks, it's looked like an old, like, medieval wizard tower or something. Very, very intrigued to, uh, to climb this one. I hope we can climb it, because we're going to try, whether we can or not. Um, oh, I see a book. Hello. Um, Never let it be said that Phineas Barclay was not a great man of science. This tower was built for his devotion to learn the secrets of the sky, a great arm reaching closer to grasp in the vast heavens with its sharp claws. But the infinite void above proved too vast, even for Phineas's big intellect. The dark void between the alluring stars is all-encompassing and inevitable. Like the Finn, thank you so much for two months of Muggly Muggly Mugs. I do appreciate that. Phineas learned that the secrets of the sky. He learned the secrets of the sky. I told you I can't read. Um, but it was too much for him to bear. The tower is now closed. Its secrets locked within. Phineas will never open its doors again. The sky itself guards these secrets now. Only thunder will open the doors of the Barclay Tower. This is the beginning of the sky's secret quest 
This is a puzzle and treasure hunt game. It takes about 90 minutes. Look for clues in the books throughout the story. Ask Ghostkeeper for details on hints. Ghostkeeper? Oh my goodness me. That is so cool. Okay, so definitely said crafters. Come and do the treasure hunt if you got if you got one of you got 90 minutes to spare because that sounds incredible. Ghostkeeper, you're here in chat, so this is perfect. Tell us a little bit about it, because I can't I don't have time to do it, unfortunately, right now, but so this will open... I, I remember you saying when the uh, when thunder happens, right? So we've got to kind of wait for it to be nighttime. It was thundering earlier. I totally got to popped in. Um, that would have been cool. Let's have a little float around the outside, shall we? Um, slim underscores forever. Thank you so much for two months of your prime smuggity subbity muggity sub. Thank you so much. Look at this thing. I kind of want to sneak inside as well. I hope, Ghostkeeper, you won't mind, will you? Because I remember up here, yeah, look, there's a whole bunch of stuff. There's maintenance access. This is how it's working here. Look, it, like, attracts attracts thunder, and then it, like, knows when the thunder's happened, and then it can, like, open the door and stuff. Very, very cool. I hope I'm not giving away any questy secrets. Um, yeah, we can... Uh, that's true. I could grab one. We have a, a Poseidon person on the server that lets you make a thunderstorm happen, so... Then the door would open, but yeah, Ghostkeeper. Does the quest go across the whole server, or is it just in the in the in the tower, or is it in the whole of the the district? I want to know. I'm curious. Or is it is it um, spoilers secrets across the whole Halloween district? Nice. That is very very cool. And it looks like we have just been raided by Azuma. Thank you so much. Hello everybody. Welcome welcome welcome. Um, I'm just a floaty head. Oh my goodness. Let me, let me get unfloaty right now. <laughs> Welcome, Raiders. Hello, hello. I'm ZF, as you may well know. Thank you so much, Azuma, for the wonderful raid. Do appreciate it, my friend. We are currently on Zedcraft checking out the uh, spooky district that was made last month. Um, but we are shortly going to be heading over to Hermitcraft um, and checking out some cool stuff there. Um, and just, just building some stuff over there as well. So do stick around. But thank you so very much for joining us. Um, Randy as well, thank you very much for 12 months of muggity muggity mug. Do appreciate the support. Um, okay, cool. Uh, Ghostkeeper, did you did you, did you you respond? Oh yeah, it was ac across the whole place, wasn't it? Very, very nice. Um, I think, I think we might have seen everything that the Spooky District has to offer. What's this little, what's this little fun place? Voltrito need to be at full hearts by T-Wolf. Oh my goodness me, we're doing this. And I am at full hearts. Okay. How? Who? How, where, when, and why? How do I get in? Oh, I'm not full hearts anymore. Where is the door? I'm confused. <laughs> the button on the floor. Can anyone see a button? Can anyone see a floor? I follow it back a little bit, maybe. I see a bun. I see it. It's right there. Ow, 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 ow. I want to be at full hearts, please. Is this a special carrot? No, it's a, it's a normal carrot. Okay. Heal myself up. Boom. Ha! Huh! Hello? Ah! My treats! The treats! No! <laughs> I'm assuming I never get them. I just get to see them. And that is my treat to see them. Well, you know, at least it's um less less off the uh off the old stomach, you know, just looking at some sweets. That'd be a lot nicer. I was not expecting Ow, ow, ow! Oh, this place is dangerous, I tell ya. My treats got tricked, totally. <laughs> they totally did. Okay, I think, I think oh, oh hello, yeah, there's something else over here as well. Cool little baby Grim Reaper guy. On a surfboard? <laughs> I did not know the Grim Reaper surfed, but um, now we do. So, yeah, look at this little guy. He's like, yeah, pointing that way. He's about to crash, though, I think. And where did he come from, anyway? I guess the ocean this way leads out that way somewhere. I'm not sure, and that is a mighty scythe. I would be very impressed if I had a scythe <laughs> such as that. But, yeah, beautiful, beautiful stuff. Well, there we go, folks. Um, That is the Zedcraft... 2021 uh, spooky, spooky district. Um, so I hope you enjoyed the little tour of it. Very, very cool to see. And obviously, if you have access 
to the Zedcraft server. Do come on, check out some of the stuff yourself if you haven't already. And hey, still build here. It's just a spooky district. It's not necessarily for Halloween. It's just for when you're feeling a bit spooky or something like that. So, um, right, we are going to quickly head on over to uh, Hermitcraft now. Bear with me for like 10 seconds and I will be right back with you in just a moment. Thank you very much. Boom.